not every day you get to see an Olympic medal or let alone wear one or even meet an Olympic athlete for that matter. But tonight at the Oilers game, nearly two dozen of Alberta's most decorated athletes are enjoying a VIP experience right here at Rogers Place thanks to a program put on by the provincial government. Recounting their experiences in Pyeongchang, you can tell the memories aren't fading anytime soon. Being able to go there and win a gold for Canada was a dream come true and and um, yeah, I loved every minute of it. Just popping on that Canada jacket on a stage like that, it's, uh, you get a pretty good sense of pride. Play against uh, some of the best players in the world and on the biggest stage too was uh, something you really can't duplicate. And they got to share those memories with fans in Edmonton with help from the provincial government's Alberta Sport Connection program. One of the things that we do after each Olympics is try to bring the athletes to show them that we appreciate what they do. Just having that support from the government, I think uh, they realize the importance of sport in our lives and hopefully will influence the next generation to do the same as we're doing. During their whirlwind trip to the capital city, they visited schools, met the premier, toured the legislature and ended at Rogers Place with a warm welcome. Alberta's own Canadian Olympic and Paralympic athletes. We poured our hearts out there in Korea and it's just uh, it's just been such a special reception here tonight and feels great to be Canadian and Albertan. Mixed doubles curler John Morris is a two-time Olympic gold medalist. Canada, and John Morris. He also has a mural in our city with fellow champion Kevin Martin. But for him, 2018 will be a hard one to top. We just had our first baby boy last Tuesday, so it's been one of the best feelings ever. Win gold in February and then have a baby boy. Carl Stollery won a bronze medal on the men's Olympic hockey team. For him, it feels just as good as a gold. It's a bronze medal win for Team Canada. Growing up in Camrose, he was raised an Oilers fan. I remember listening to Marley Scott and Rod Phillips back in the day when, when they were so good. And, and then uh, to get the opportunity to come here and be honoured at the game is, uh, is very cool. Jack Leach won his gold in the Paralympics as an alpine guide for blind skier Mac Marcou. Comes to the line, Marcou has smashed it! It's honestly tough to put in words still. It's, uh, it was an unbelievable experience. Recounting those moments and sharing them with the world as everything they've ever worked for is proudly displayed around their necks. That's the first thing you notice how heavy it is when you put it on and uh, it's, uh, it's pretty cool, uh, just to feel, and uh, I don't think it's going to get old, just showing everyone. For all the latest news and event announcements at Rogers Place, as well as construction updates in Ice District, visit our website and follow us on social media. Don't forget to get your tickets to the many exciting concerts and events coming to Rogers Place this year. For Ice Level, I'm Jessica Kent. Thanks for watching.